It's actually a rainy day today. Uh, it was pouring earlier for once, but still a beautiful day. I just gotta work and you know I'm doing that. Never stop, never stop, always on attack. Locked in the path, never getting off track. Whatever I lack, add it to my bag. And I got plenty more where that came from. And my price is right, I never change. But I don't get it done, get it done right. And that's every day, that's the life. Oh. First off, 25K with good. It's so awesome to see that the channel's still growing. I know I'm all over the place, haven't been dunking that much, so I know it's been pretty slow, but I never even thought I'd even get to any K, let, let alone 25K, so that's really awesome. I have the podcast, I have my own little life coach career going on, I love making videos, I love doing everything I do, so it's fun that it's still reaching new people, and I hope you guys see the whole theme of everything is just mainly that energy, that inspiration. I love doing all of that, and I love sharing it with you guys, and just contributing, because when I watch YouTube videos, it's fun to see people being, uh, chasing their dreams, and just doing the most, and trying to make the most out of their lives, so that's what my channel's about, so super cute. Anyway, today, uh, I'm going to the gym again, but again, hamstring is still bummed out. I'm gonna do more vert jumps. I'm looking forward to jumping a little bit better today, hopefully get that two-hand rim grab, uh, other than that, just trying to get some jump stimulus. My body's feeling great energy-wise, and the rest of my muscles are feeling good except for that hamstring. So just going to take it easy, but I do think that these standing vert jumps are helping my jump form and also helping me mentally for my dribble dunks, things like that. So I don't think I'm really losing any vert. I'm still getting some max jumps in. So I think when I come back, meaning when my hamstring's a little healthy and I can do my full approach, I'll just be jumping better than ever. Hopefully that's soon. We'll keep an eye on it. But uh, just going with the flow doing what my body needs, always making progress, let's get it, and anything else? So, I put my bag down in the gym to go to the court, and when I went to put my, my dunk shoes on, my hamstring was just super tight and painful, and I kind of noticed it. I already knew that, but I, it was just like, I definitely shouldn't jump today. So I took it easy, did some other explosive things that I didn't feel my hamstring at all, meaning I did the kettlebell swings, which I barely bent my legs, so it just really felt like I'm doing something explosive that's for jumping that doesn't affect my hamstring at all, cause any tension, which is really good. Then I did some jump squats with more force, definitely felt good there. Yesterday I did some upper body and some abs, and the abs I do are really heavy on leg lifts, meaning like my hips, which I think was a problem with my hamstrings to begin with because my hips are so tight that it's causing even more tension and, and uh, tightness in my hamstrings. So I really wanna work on my hips because I feel like loosening that will help my ham hamstring. That's what helped in the, in the past, but I also just think my hamstring needs rest. So other than that, good workout, super light. I'm just trying to get healthy so I can jump again because that's the main focus. Hopefully in a few more days I can jump again, even if it's just drop step or standing vert, and then back to full approach. You know the deal, it's how we do it. Yeah, stay tuned for a really good podcast coming out. Probably me solo first, but then I have a, no a new special guest coming, which I'm super pumped for. It's been a while since I've been trying to get him on. It's dunk related, and uh, yeah, that's probably gonna come out next week sometime. Stay tuned, and that's it. Enjoy your life, another great day. Keep making progress. Keep listening to your body, that's the most important. You can give it what it needs. It's hard for me because I wanna get ready for dunk camp and I wanna fly, but I gotta do what's right for me now. You know the deal. All right, love you all, see ya. Yo, whew, all right, yo. Super pumped today. Had to get my little podcast poster up because I have a good podcast coming up today. Today, feeling super good because I'm actually healthier than I thought I would be. I'm really happy today because I woke up feeling healthy. If you've been following my Instagram, I woke up on Monday, like three days ago, feeling a little tickle in my throat, my allergies acting up, and that usually leads to sickness. I felt super fatigued. My energy was low, which is unlike me, and so I'm just happy to be feeling good. Headed to the gym, about to jump a little bit. Hamstring, rested a little extra because I felt like I was getting sick, so that's a plus. Still gotta go light on it. Always freaking working. I just gotta really take care of my body as a priority because I have such high goals, I can't 
rush it. I really gotta be patient, and it's really tough because I wanna make better videos, and I wanna make sick dunk videos, but I, I, I gotta do what's right for my body at this time. So I really appreciate you guys sticking along, and uh, if you guys know that it's been a long journey and it's taking forever, but I am definitely have huge goals. I'm definitely, I definitely have huge goals, and 44 inches by dunk camp, but other than that, just massive game dunks. Just YouTube T-dub in-game, and that's literally what I wanna do. I wanna dunk every little step I get towards the basket. I wanna go up on people. I wanna catch alley-oops and putbacks and just bang in game. That's pretty much it. Anyway, happy holidays, happy Passover, happy Easter, happy birthday to my boy Mac, and happy birthday to Nana. Shout out Nana, what's good? Yo, I think I left my ball here last time and it's not in my trunk, so I think I left it here. I think I have to get a new one. Nobody ever returns your ball, they just take it, especially when it's a dunk life ball. and a half. Yesterday I was, I realized I wasn't as sick as I was, so I did some prep work for today. Just did some uh, Romanian deadlifts, get my hamstring a little healthy, and did some pistols and different things to kind of prep for today. It was on my Instagram story. Um, so today, feeling really good, but uh, definitely feeling a little fatigued, like I can't really exert myself too much, or else I'm gonna make my immune system really low. But uh, definitely looking forward to getting back to jumping. I think after today my hamstring will probably be good. Still gonna keep it very minor, not gonna do full approach jumps for a while, but work up to full approach, hopefully jump super high next week. Let's go. I also got a new lens. I didn't wanna use it as my main vlogging because it's expensive and I didn't wanna get it damaged, but no one's in the gym, so I'm gonna try it out right now. Let's go. Three, three, two, one, new lens. Yeah, I think it's crispy. Hey, good news is my left right, my left knee is feeling great. No pain whatsoever. I feel like I can jump off it even as my dominant leg left right. Let's go. Yo, voiceover, what's good? This left hamstring, the push off into my penultimate is what caused the pain in the first place. So I'm really trying to avoid that, but I, that's why I can barely jump. I just wanted to kind of point that out and show exactly what caused it. I think that's enough for my hamstring. If I do a little more, I think I'm gonna really aggravate it, especially right left, I can't push off it. A couple more vert jumps, I'm doing more than I thought I would be able to do. I thought I was gonna stick to just drop step. I was able to do a couple steps, it feels pretty good. I uh, definitely don't wanna overdo it. I know it's super slow, trust me. The patience is super hard for me. I wanna make the best videos, I wanna dunk like crazy. But uh, gotta stay disciplined to what my body needs so I can keep making progress. I know it takes forever. Stick with me. Even though it's such baby jumps, standing vert and one step have always been my weakness. So at least I get to work on my weakness. When I get to full approach, it should be killer. Everything's feeling healthy as ever. Like my knees feel really strong. I feel super balanced, so that's really great. If you've been watching, it's been really hard to uh, get over that hump of feeling strong on my knee, but now I'm doing left, right, which is huge. So I'm really feeling left, right coming back, get my form perfect and be more versatile, jump off the dribble both directions. So I'm pumped about that as well, but patience. I'm loving this lens. All right, so. Definitely a positive day. I woke up yesterday thinking I wasn't even gonna be able to jump for a few days because I thought I was gonna get sick, but I woke up feeling even better, so I'm happy about that. And then I also realized that yesterday going to the gym, I wanted to film that, but it was just too much work and I really needed to focus on my body and it was stressful to try to make a video. So my point is, I wanna make this content for you guys. 
but I want to make every video quality and valuable. I really want to post every single workout I do, but I just don't have the time and I have other things I want to post. But I just want you to know I'm super pumped. All the content I'm making is so in line with what I feel I want to share. I love being inspired by watching other podcasts and I feel like I'm finally being able to do that with my own, getting my message out there. And I really hope that you guys feel that you can start doing what you want to do and that's what I want to share and that energy and I love I love being part of that energy and I feel super pumped today because I got my energy back a little bit because uh, I really thought I was going to be sick but just feeling great got my new lens getting a freaking haircut today might go long with it who the hell knows might get a mullet I don't know what's going on but I'm loving it hope you guys enjoy your day and uh, I think that's it enjoy the holidays enjoy the weekend we'll be back I really love posting videos and I love that you guys it's still growing somehow I, I just have I just have fun I have a good time everything is good thanks All right, we're live. What's good, Chuck? <laughs> What's going on, man? Good to see you. Good to have you on. Good to see you. I'm happy to finally be on. I know. After, we've had this for a while. Like a year and a half. 